Okay, John. I'm gonna get out of your hair eventually, man. I know I know you're getting tired of me nope, asking you about the all, trucks. Quinn. But I've got to have the day with this star. Yep. I know we tried it a little earlier and this Wi-Fi thing just messed us up really, really bad. But could you please one more time send us through this? The fans are really asking me about this. Yeah. What's up with this beautiful star? Well, this this is really beautiful truck. It, the color is outstanding on it. It's yes, a Western it is. star. I happen to have the dealer here. Quinn, we can introduce you to Jeremy Simpson with Jenkins Diesel. Hey, John, how are you? Very good, good, Jeremy. He's going to give you the full rundown on it, Quinn. Thank you, John. Yeah, I can. So. Jeremy, how you doing, buddy? Doing great, doing great. My yep. name is Jeremy Simpson. I'm with Jenkins Diesel Power out of Springfield, Missouri. We're a Western Star Truck dealership. Jim, this, this rig is stunning, man. It's like the Incredible Hulk standing up here. Yeah. Introduce me to this piece of equipment, please. Well, this particular truck is the Western Star 5700 XE. It was uh, the first aerodynamic truck that Western Star came out with. They introduced it in late 2015, and this particular model is in 2018. But the whole idea behind the truck is a lighter weight, more aerodynamic, and more cost-effective truck on the market for you. Okay. Um, details that went into this truck, um, the total cost effectiveness was, like for instance, the headlights, the halogenic headlight bulb rather than a high-priced LED bulb. It's a three-piece headlamp, so if you break just an outer piece like the blinker lap assembly, you can get just that part. You don't have to buy the whole thing at a high price. Okay. The okay. same way with the front bumper. It's a four-piece front bumper. You got your outer pieces, which we call our fangs, our chrome overlay, and then our fiberglass centerpiece. And you can get those pieces bought individually. So if you run into a stop sign, bust just a fang, we can buy just a fang for you and save you some money. Okay. Um, real stainless steel accents, not plastic overlay. It's real stainless steel on a Western Star. Um, the 5700 XE comes equipped Detroit exclusive. You can get either a DD13, DD15, or DD16. This particular one's DD16, set at 530 horse, 1850 torque, and we can upgrade that to a 600 horse for you. Oh, really, wow. really easy. Um, as you go around, you notice the doors on the Western Stars. We don't have piano hinges. We have internal automotive style hinges. There's two of them. And what that does for you, this is the stoutest hinge on the market. It's over a quarter inch thick, but your door doesn't sag over time like a typical piano hinge will sag okay. over time. Exactly. Yeah. Um, I got a quick question for you, yep. Jim. What, I, I, we're looking at this rig with this super beautiful uh, sleeper on that. What would a standard bunk Western Star weigh in conjunction to where we're at right now? Uh, about 17.5. I've got a lot of, with an 82 inch stratosphere sleeper, about 17.5. And this baby is how big? This is an ARI 144 inch side door sleeper. Okay. And then we have that paired up with a 34 inch rest cap from Western Star. So all together, you got about 178 inches of sleeper on here. Now explain that rest cap to us. That's gonna be a, deep, uh, a Western Star exclusive item. Um, we just, what that does, just gives you another 34 inches before we mount the ARI sleeper on there. And what that does for you, it gives us an extra high entryway you'll see when we go inside. Okay. As we transfer from the cab to the sleeper, you can stand up in the driver's seat and walk straight into the sleeper. You don't have to worry about hitting your head, nothing like that. You get a good tall entryway. Wow. Uh, oh, I love these boxes. Look at that box, man. Yeah, a lot of extra storage. These two boxes are just empty storage. Uh, you just can put everything you need. Your, your uh, flat better guys, then no need to even have a headache rack anymore when you buy an ARI sleeper. Oh, We're okay. going to reinforce the back wall from the factory, and that eliminates the, the use of the headache rack. You've got plenty of storage box for all your chains, your locking mechanisms for your loads, all that good stuff. Uh, inside this box here, you have a 7500 series on end generator. Okay. And those things will last longer than the truck will last, I think. I mean, Outstanding. They're, just, they're known for the quality. What uh, size tanks we got on there? Dual 120s on this particular one. Okay, okay. Yep. Now uh, I noticed we got these beautiful w, WTIs on here. Yeah, WTI fenders, double hump fenders. Uh, they're about as good as they come. They're about the only brand we would put on anymore. So you recommend uh, this yes. this particular yes, application? I do. Yep, lifetime warranty on their products, no questions asked. Now I, look at that gleaming back wall. Yep. Outstanding. Now, any outside of just being gorgeous, is there any other African aesthetics associated with this? Um, yeah, I mean, you can, of course, you can get different options with different sleepers. You know, we can get a side door, we can get a rear door, uh, we can get a no door. It all just depends on what you want. Oh, wow. Uh, that's the good thing about the ARI is they customize your sleeper about better than anybody out there. They, it's amazing what ARI can do up there at the factory for you. And that's one of those 
uh, greaseless fifth wheels, correct? It is. It's aluminum fifth wheel to uh, shed down on weight. We were all our trucks with disc brakes all the way around. Uh, now that's a hot item, I've noticed. It is it's really a hot. Big talk of the town, right? uh, benefits from a DOT standpoint, right now there's no way to check adjustments, so you don't have to worry about getting it taken for a brake out of adjustment. Oh, okay. Um, the brakes last about three times as long as a typical drum brake would last. Um, and the stopping distance is about one quarter less stopping distance. So if somebody wow. cuts you off, these things stop on a dime. And could a person get that on his trailer too to, to yes. coincide and work yes, with the truck? Absolutely. And of course, on the, uh, a good point on the Western Star trucks, if you look down this frame rail, all your wiring harnesses, all your airlines are on one inch standoff points, meaning there's nothing touching the frame. So that eliminates any chafing of your airlines and your electrical boards as they wow. come down the frame rail. You don't ever have to worry about them chafing on the frame rail. Outstanding. Yep. Well, Jeremy, I tell you what, you've shown me the outside of this beautiful unit. How about look? Let's take a look on the inside of it and really wow the general public here. Yeah, come on in. Wow, guys, look at this. Look at this. Like I said, this is. Now we're gonna start, Jeremy. We're actually gonna go from the office area. Okay. Into yep. Yep. the this living is, quarters. This is the business area up here. Um, Probably the biggest advantage of a Western Star cab is the dimensions of the Western Star cab. It's a really wide cab. It's a full 72 inches. You notice I can stand sideways between the seats. I got plenty of room to move from side to side. You're not having to turn sideways and squeeze through the seats trying to get back into your sleep. Wow, look at that, guy. That, and the, that's a lot of room. The cab, safest, safest cab on the market. It's all galvanized steel cab. So if you sit down in, in your seat, mm -hmm. how, how comfortable is that? in conjunction to most other trucks? Oh, they're extremely comfortable. We order them all with the best seats we can get from Western Star. Um, usually a good leather seat, three different lumbars. Uh, of course, typical tilt and, and uh, uh, tilt steering wheel so you can adjust it to be comfortable. You're gonna be really comfortable. Uh, this particular truck has the DT12 automated shift transmission from Detroit in it. Uh, all your shifting and all your jake brakes gonna be done right here on your right hand paddle. So you don't have a shifter right here in your way, mm -hmm. taking up space as you're trying to get out of the driver's seat and come back here and relax for the night. Now, this is, I know you told us, this is a rest cab, right? It is. Look at the cabinetry just associated with this extension on your, your cab unit here. Yep. And is this part of your application or is this part of ARI? This is actually Western Star. That's one of the things that Western Star is known for, known for is cherry wood cabinets, real wood cabinets. They're not fake wood, they're real wood cabinets. So if a person wanted to spec this truck, it would actually come with those cabinets already in yep. there before it even got to the custom sleeper manufacturer. Correct, right. Yep. Outstanding. So now, let's look at the living quarters of this. Okay. And you walk us through this beautiful, beautiful layout here. Okay. Yeah, we kind of customized this one a little bit different than a lot of our other sleepers. Uh, one thing we did, we took the side door, it's typically about eight inches farther back than what this one is. Mm -hmm. We moved it about eight inches farther forward. And the reason we did that was we have a bigger cabinet space here because we actually cut off some of the cabinet space in the back because we wanted to put an extra big bed in this one. It's a 56 inch wide mattress in this particular one. Wow. Yeah, it's huge. It's a queen so, size almost. Huh? Instead of a uh, two burner cooktop, we did the one burner new wave. Um, heater top on there that way you when you're done cooking with that you can just unplug it store it in any of the storages and you're done and all that's just extra space uh, just about like all your other ARI sleepers we have the shower and uh, toiletry in here mm -hmm. um, and this particular one comes with a 40 gallon fresh water tank so you got plenty of water and you've got about a five gallon hot water tank so um, so, Jim, do me a favor. I want you to have a seat over there on that, yep. that, that lounge area. Yep. Look how easy this is, guys. See how easy yeah. he just went in there? And you got room for two people to sit in there. Oh, easily. Yeah, so, if you got company, that, if you're sitting in a rest area or at the truck stop and you have some buddies come over, they can just, or, or your wife and, and oh, some yeah. of the kids that are with you, you guys can actually sit down to a dinner meal oh, right, yeah, right at them. We've had seven or eight people at a time in these things sitting on a truck stop. You know, we travel with them all the time selling them. I mean, people just want to get in, and if we're cooking dinner, we just invite them on in, and we have dinner together. Wow. So, let me ask you this, Jeremy. Now, Jeremy, when, when, when it comes to an opportunity for someone to come to your dealership, where would they find you guys? Um, 1845 East Blaine Street, Springfield, Missouri. Springfield, yep. okay. Jenkins Diesel Power. There's only one Jenkins Diesel Power in the whole world, and it is us. So, do you have a website and a, a number you want to share with the client? Uh, oh. JenkinsDiesel.com. You can find anything you need right there. Uh, my cell phone number is the easiest way to get a hold of me. It's 417 
425-6004. That's the best way to get hold of me. I've got that on me just about everywhere I go. And Jim, if this man is willing to give you his cell number, he's serious about his application of selling these trucks. And let's just take a look at how serious this rig is. And this is spanked. Ready to roll right now, Jeremy. We're going to leave here, and this this is road ready right now. Ready it to is go, road right? ready. I'm going to show you one more thing under the hood before we finish up. The, Fantastic. The ease of maintenance of the Detroit diesel engine. All right. So Let's tell you yeah, what's the stars we're now on for. One thing I wanted to show you, uh, well, on the driver's side, is actually one of the key components to own in a Detroit diesel with a 5700 XE truck. Okay. Is as a driver, when you want to check all your fluids, you don't want to have to turn the wheel and crawl in here where it's tight. You're going to get dirty, you're going to get greasy. It's going to be a nasty job. Uh -huh. So the whole idea of the way this was set up was ease of maintenance. You can check all your fluid levels, the top off all your fluid levels, standing on the outside of the front tire. Oh, really? You've got a washer fluid. You've got a big oversized washer fluid fill that you can easily reach. Our oil filters, fuel filters, oil fill and antifreeze, and our fuel water separator, power steering. As you can see, I can put my hands on all this stuff from the outside of the tire. So I'm not having to crawl in there where your, your, your greasable joints are and get greasy and nasty. So as a driver, you purchase a truck like this, you don't want to get out here and get greasy and then right. get it back in your truck. Right. You know, so that's just a, a good key component to the Detroit so engine. Western Star actually had the driver in mind when they designed this these oh, applications. Absolutely. absolutely. So Jeremy, thank you, man, so very much for this yeah, awesome no, tour. Well, I'm, I'm pretty sure that we're going to be coming down to spend some time at your dealership uh, this summer. And I just want everybody to know, this has been a truly awesome experience for me. I had no idea that Western Star had put so much love into their equipment and the drivers and owners of this equipment. So, Jeremy, on that note, thank you so very much. Thank and you, I will definitely be knocking down your door this summer. And I want you to show me that beautiful lot I heard about down there, okay? All right, thanks a lot. All right, guys. That's it. We're coming from uh, Louisville, Kentucky, the Mid-America Truck Show at ARI's booth. We'll see you guys next year. Love you. Keep on trucking. Everybody's gone. Hey, guys. Just wanted to welcome you to Matt's uh, ARI Legacy Sleepers. And we want to give a shout out to all the ARI owners, all the future ARI owners. This is the crew. we got a great crew. Um, we want to make sure we let everybody know we appreciate the business and any future business. Come on down to booth 32265 and give us a talk. You know, talk to us. We'd love to help you. Welcome, Welcome to, Max, to Max 2018. 2018. Outstanding. See you guys.